Gamers Eve Heard, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, we are checking out our reward for getting every single character challenge done. Between episodes, I was able to get the pea shooter challenges done, like I said before, by just going to the story mode and just sort of attacking and doing whatever I needed to do. It was pretty simple, it was just a little time consuming, but because of that, we have gotten every single character challenge done, and along with it, we have gotten the Scare Cob hat, which Rux is holding for us right now. I wanted to give a quick heads up while the game is frozen. <laughs> Um, if it doesn't show up for Rux, you might have to restart your game and or your console. Sometimes it was just a little weird with it. I, I read that other people were having the same issue. I found this in Crazy Dave's attic. I mean, Crazy Dave gave it to me to give to you. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay. Um, wait, did he give it to me? Uh, I don't know. Did it break again? It said he had something. Uh, no, well, see, it still says he has something. Maybe it's still broken. Um, view inventory. Does he still have it? He's he's very picky about this for some reason. Um, let me see if I can't go to Colonel Corn and see if it's there. If not, I might actually have to reset my game several more times, who knows? Uh, but it would be in hats, and it's not here. All right, well, this is an unsolved mystery. I was about to restart the game, and then he gave it to me. There we go, we got the scare cob. <laughs> So let's go ahead and equip that for our Colonel Corn, and that's what we'll play with today. Unfortunately, I don't think it's a legendary or even a Spectrum hat. It is just a, it is just a rare hat. So as you can see, um, it sort of has like a scarecrow with a hay and everything, and a crow that actually moves around, which is pretty cool. I like that feature to it. So definitely, we'll be playing as a Colonel Corn today first, just with the hat, and then maybe we'll add some customizations on as we go through. I don't know how crazy of today's episode will be, but. I do want to make more progress in Turf Takeover Tactical. If we could find a way to get four Vanquish Chicas Colonel Corn, if that's even possible, that would be fantastic. Okay, so let's get into the Colonel Corn action. Looks like we are on the plants side, of course, and we are on whatever map this is called. I never remember the map names. <laughs> that's for any game I play. <laughs> Anyways, we're pushing the payload. Like I said before, if we could find a way to get a four Vanquish Streak, that's a good start in this uh, game mode. We'll be doing really well for ourselves. Let me spawn in some plants that might be able to help help us push this payload as the going gets rough, because that can happen at times. But yeah, so far I like this hat. I would love to hear, have you been able to earn up this Scarecrow hat? Okay, who is that? Where is that? It's this guy. That didn't count? Oh, looks like somebody else got to him first. That's a shame. That happens though. Okay, so it seems like there's actually... Okay, there he is, there he is, be careful. Okay, no, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. I gotta keep the one Vanquish I got. I can't get a Vanquish Sheik. If I get Vanquish, no, no, leave me alone. Leave me alone, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to be that person who just runs around all the time the moment they're in danger to any degree. But at the same time, I really need to survive this. It looks like the 80s action hero just took out a huge grouping of people. Come on, come on. Oh, he's at like no health. He's at like no health. Get him over here. Ah, oh, darn. Apparently my plant pot got it though, so at least it's a little bit of experience one way or another. That's an assist, not a Vanquish. They're strikingly different things. Come on, come on. Okay, get him, get him, get him, get him. He doesn't see me. And that was a vanquish. We're at two out of four. So I'm very focused in on this at the moment. We'll talk about the hat in a minute. <laughs> okay, you definitely toss it up there. Go for, ah! No, don't get me, please. Please, I'm desperate. The sooner we get this, the better. Oh, scientists all over the place. He got launched. Oh, there's a couple of people. Come on, this could be it right here. Yeah, there's three, there's three. No, <laughs> leave me alone, leave me alone. How risky should I go? I could husk hop over somebody, but if I don't get it, I'm gonna be really upset. Oh no. Is he still up? Oh, he's still up here. He doesn't know, he's none the wiser. Yeah, 30,000 coins, thank you very much. Okay, let's talk about the Scarecrow hat. Of course, we got it for completing every single character challenge, which was quite the feat. Of course, it took four episodes worth of just uh, taking on all these challenges, two for the plants, two for the zombies. We did an episode on each one, so if you're stuck on any of the challenges, while there's still time left in Lawn of Doom, definitely go and check out those episodes and maybe you can get a couple of tips. Uh, I think that out of the four of them, I think the most challenging to me was probably the Citron. I think that was the one that had me, oh man, wow, okay, take the most time and effort and energy. The one that was the easiest was definitely the Scientist. I had the most fun with that one too. Just the Scientist is really, really fun in this game. He has all the charms of the Scientist in Garden Warfare 2 and Garden Warfare 1, but I feel like even then, like he's just like wrapped together in a nice way in this game. 
So that was a ton of fun. So I think that the effort was well worth it because we also got a lot of bulbs that's been helping us get through Lawn of Doom. It's probably the most efficient way to earn bulbs is to get the character challenges done because you're also earning experience while you're doing all that, which is gonna get you the prize bulb meter So overall, it's definitely worth it. I would definitely put your time into it and you get five of them for completing all the challenges. So hopefully, you know, some of my videos were able to help some of you. And definitely, a lot of people didn't realize that you could go into story mode and still complete most of the challenges. Unless the challenges specifically entail you to take on real life players, they can be done on non real life players, which I don't think there was even any challenges that had you do that. So like, yeah, you can use the story mode. Oh, there we go, that was good. I got taken out, but it was worth it. And because we did all that, not only did we get all those bulbs, but we got this scarecrow hat. And who knows, maybe this hat will never show up again. So it's pretty, pretty cool to get it. I wish it was legendary, something to that tier. It feels a little lackluster for the amount of work, but like I said, it's still worth it because of the, all the other rewards. And the hat itself is pretty cool. I figured after this round, we would maybe do, um, like maybe some kind of getup. I don't know what other costume piece. I don't really have too many customizations for Colonel Corn, but maybe we have enough of something that I can customize and make some kind of cool looking thing set up. Okay, how about no, okay. That didn't work out the way I thought it would. Sometimes Colonel Corn will jump up sort of high, but not go very far horizontally. And then sometimes he'll go really far. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so far, I'm happy with the hat. I'm happy that I was able to earn it up. I'm really hoping that we get enough bulbs to actually finish Lawn of Doom. I'm getting really less and less on time. I've been working hard on it though. I've been working hard on trying to get these videos out. Uh, the next couple of episodes will all be Lawn of Doom f themed. We have this one. Next episode, I'll be showcasing the Doom Rose costume. Oh, you don't see me. Let's see if I can't get you, or will this be too late? Oh, oh, come on. Yeah, look at that. Okay, we're doing pretty good today. I'm happy with it. Gotta watch out for this. Ready for this? Super Husk Hop, I hit the ceiling. There's always something that makes that go wrong, isn't there? Come on, get him, get him, get him. Oh no, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. Where'd he go? Whoa, he went flying. But that was a vanquish. No, don't do it. Save me, Citron, save me. <laughs> I'm not behind your shield. Okay, let's push this payload a little bit. We definitely got a tad bit distracted there. Uh, these guys are still all up in our face, which I definitely don't appreciate. That didn't get you at all. Okay, just keep pushing. I have no idea where he is. We're getting experience for pushing the payload at the least. What level are we? We're level nine, so we're just about to reach um, level 10 for Colonel Corn. that's pretty cool. Uh, is there, there's people behind us too. This is definitely a tough spot for the plants where a lot of people can close in. Excuse me, personal boundaries. Thank you. Okay, <laughs> where's this mech at? Here he is. I heard him shooting his missiles everywhere. Be gone. Ooh, got the Citron up there. Using the laser, pretty good job from him. Oh no, oh no. There we go. That worked. We're doing better than I think I've ever done as Colonel Corn in this game before. This is this is amazing. I'm really happy right now. <laughs> okay, come on. You better run. I'm trying to mess with our team. Not if I have anything to say about it. Ow, ooh. Come on, get him. We're working fantastically as a team right now. I'm, I'm really happy with everybody here. Gotta get rid of that uh, scientist first. If we don't, then uh, he's just gonna keep healing the 80s action hero. I'm gonna try to put that there, so hopefully we can damage down some stuff. Be gone, Dr. Heels. No more healing for the zombies. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Nothing. That's a time six vanquish streak we have going on right now. The sunflower is definitely making the big difference. She's healing everybody up, so thank you so much for doing that. Engineer is taken down. That was just an assist, though. Oh no, ooh, that hurts. Ouch, ooh, there it goes. That's fine. Oh wow, I didn't even see you up there. <laughs> Very good tactic. That's for sure. Okay, so he's jumping out of there. Oh, there's a soldier right here. Somebody got him. I guess it was sort of me. I got the last hit at the least. Oh, there we go, level 10 reach. That's super exciting. No, you don't, no, you don't. I gotta go right under you. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Out of ammo. And there it is. Is there somebody over this way? It's an engineer. Oh, I got him directly with one of them. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. I don't know where I'm going right now. Oh, this guy's a heal thing on him but I can get him. Wow, this is this is really going good. And that's an assist. So the payload's bye-bye. That, that got rid of the wall and everything. But yeah, like I said before, definitely let me know if you've gotten this hat before you've gotten those challenges done. 
I'm really excited for more of the Lawn of Doom stuff though. Like I really hope I can get it done. I'm hoping that if I can time it right, I can showcase the final costume for Super Brains on Halloween day, but I don't know if that'll work. I'll have to wait and see. Anyways, we did a fantastic job getting out this far. Let's see what I can get away with. Oh, well, not that. <laughs> okay, come on, Husk Cop. Did that hit you at all? Yes, it did. Ooh, okay. Maybe a little bit, my focuses weren't the best there. I could have probably gotten the battery moved around with it. We'll try again. Somebody's coming in with the bomb right now, which is not supposed to say bomb. It's supposed to say battery, I thought. Was that changed at some point? Because that's not right. <laughs> I swear it usually would say battery, but I might be wrong. Okay, somebody was attacking me. I don't know who from where, but they keep knocking me back into the blast zone of the thing. Oh no, you don't. Oh, you were so close to getting taken out. I'm so close to getting taken out, I gotta be careful. Let's toss that down there, the butter. We can sort of see where they are and react accordingly. Okay, so I'm gonna run in and just sort of grab what I can. Thank you, goodbye. Ah, oh, oh, that hurts, that hurts. Somebody help. <laughs> Come on, go, go, go. Ah, oh, they're right behind me, I know it. Hey, heal me, heal me, heal me. Okay, well, it's the thought that counts, I guess. Goodbye. Come on, oh, we we're almost there. Are they chasing me? Oh, they're chasing me, I don't like it, somebody help. <laughs> Stay together. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> There we go. And nice, it looks like that Citron just got it too. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Leave my plant friends alone. Not happening, not happening. Okay, maybe it's happening. There we go, we got it. <laughs> oh man, I'm having a lot of fun today. So let's let this guy get revived. I got your back, dude. I might be a little late, but I, I, I got it. Okay, is anybody else grabbing batteries right now? There's an engineer causing problems from who knows where. And I have to be careful about that. Definitely throwing the butter in is a huge help. You can get an idea of exactly who's where. That didn't get you, but it got your turret, which is good. Um, I'm gonna husk hop over her, maybe, or not. Um, oh my gosh, I I'm going. Oh, I got her still. <laughs> can I pick up the battery? Come on, picking it up. I got it. Battery stolen. I get experience for stealing the battery, cool. Keep running. I know there is a scientist right behind me. I can hear him attacking. I'm just gonna keep running. Just gonna keep running. Come on. So yeah, if that Citron cashes in and I cash in too, that's the win right there. What a great round. Like, we destroyed them. That was fantastic. You saved the day and the lighthouse. Now let's name all of the eels. How many eels are there to name? Can we name one George? Okay, so a fantastic round to start with, with the Scarecrow hat for the Colonel Corn. And next round, we're gonna go ahead and customize them a little bit too. I might have gotten like top angle streak or something there. Or, that's right, that's not a thing in this game. You don't get the uh, the recognition for that. But I still might have also gotten top angle streak. Like, I feel like we did really good. So I really want to see. But then after that, we'll move to the next round. But I'm so glad we got the challenge done. The 30,000 coins. I've been working for that. And we finally got it. So now I don't have to worry about it if uh, it moves to the next weekly event. We got all the challenges done. I think I might have some daily challenges, but I don't know if any of those will apply to what I'm currently doing. So I actually didn't, there was a pea shooter who got 22 vanquishes, well good for you. I must have gotten close behind that, I feel like I was around that many vanquishes. But it was a lot of fun, really good round for sure. Uh, let's see, 19, so yeah, pretty good. And let's see, got that done, 30,000 coins, and now we need to vanquishes, get vanquishes on the carousel. Oh, in Giddy Park. I don't know why this is like a check. This has been a check for for like two days now. <laughs> All right, so I don't have too many customizations as the Colonel Corn, and I forgot to go level them up. Most of them are part of the 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 one set, the uh, the corny set. So I'll just do what I can. Sorry, I don't have much. This is it. <laughs> Does it look better? I don't know. Probably not. But at least it looks different. <laughs> That's for sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm having a good time with this. It definitely is an interesting hat. I think that this hat would look good with a costume. I feel like it'd be really cool to see a full on Scarecrow Colonel Corn, which hey, maybe at some point. I wonder, when it comes to the challenges, we don't really know too much about them. Will there be more challenges every event? Maybe there'll be a challenge every month? Because every week you got a new key. So I can only imagine that means, you know, once a month, we'll have a new event maybe? Where, well, once a month we'll have a new set of challenges. That would be really cool if there's always a, 
thing to work towards like that. That would be a lot of fun. So that's what I'm gonna hope for. Well, let's see how well we can defend. If we can defend well here, maybe I'll move to a different game mode or something. I'll definitely go and level up the Colonel Corn. Okay, so where's the scientist at? Oh, 80's action here over this way. Throwing this down. And then he's sort of going for me. Okay, Husk Cop, Husk Cop. Oh, that got him. I'm running. <laughs> I'm running away. I don't want to go too, I don't like going past like here. Because after this, I feel like I'm all up in their spawn and it's not fair. But also, like, how are the teams? They have six players, we have eight. Like, that's not really fair either. I'd, I'd go join their, their their team, but like, then I wouldn't be doing what I'm supposed to be doing for today's episode, what do you know? I'm just gonna stand here, get all steamy. There's the 80s action here again. Somebody got him. I just, I feel like that's always so unfair, right? Just to sit there on a high point and just vanquish them so they can't get by. That's sort of where a lot of people have actually been letting me know their criticism of this game mode. And definitely I can sort of see that for this weekly event. Is that for specific points like this, it's impossible to push because you just need pure uh, organized numbers to really get past certain points. And you can't really do that in a point like this. You really need more than eight players. So we wanted to get up there. Because at this point, I don't see them getting over here at all. I don't think that's gonna work out very well. So I got this set up for our Colonel Corn. It's, it's nothing crazy, but these are the only customizations I have for him, are for the corny set, the glasses and the fanny pack around his neck. So that's what he looks like now. I hope it's good. But he's reached level 10, so let's go ahead and promote him right over this way. Wait, what? You don't have anything to say to me? I just want to promote my Colonel Corn. So this will be rapid recob ammo upgrade. Cob Busters gain faster reload, which could definitely be useful. That's an upgrade I would definitely use in Garden Warfare 2. And then Mob Cobs damage upgrade. Cob Busters pierce through enemies. Really? That could be potentially very good depending on the situation. So definitely, I'm gonna to try to get Colonel Corn up to his next set of levels, we'll see how far we get, but definitely I wanna apply that rapid recob, if not anything else, because I think that could be very useful. We'll take a look at everything. Uh, so we'll run over this way really fast. And not pea shooter. I don't know why it wants me to go to pea shooter. I wanna unequip this stuff. So I had low life, I had leveling up, I had ready up, which is use weapons and abilities faster after sprinting. I don't know if I need that as much anymore. I feel like I'm getting a little more comfortable with the game at this point, and I can handle some other stuff. So super spin increased rate of fire for a short time by earning a vanquish. That sounds good. Buttered branches could be okay, but where's rapid recap? That's only two points. So we could do uh, fearless, regenerate health when near multiple enemies, uh, gain health by earning a vanquish. That sounds good. Um, and then let's do that. If, if we have a good round again, that could be a potentially very, very powerful setup. So we'll try something like that. We'll go back into the action and hope for the best. Okay, we're back in the action. I'm not doing the turf takeover tactical anymore because I always feel like it is more fun with more players. It has been interesting trying the less players, but there are certain maps that just don't work as well for it in my opinion. That seemed to be a big criticism that you guys had is that certain maps just simply, you cannot get past the point with that many characters or that few characters, I guess. Um, on the attacking side, it could be tough. And we definitely experienced that a couple of times. But now that I've gotten all the challenges done, I don't have to worry about it as much. So I'm pretty happy to say that there are a lot of zombies coming in. So let's be careful. I wanna try to time my butter throw correctly. We have a full stack of teammates though, but also a full stack of enemies. So we, we just gotta be careful all around. The double super brains is making me scared right now. Uh, that turned out okay, uh, but there's still more. There's so many people, and none of them are my teammates. <laughs> What's going on? Where are my teammates? Sunflower, heal me. Oh no, that Sunflower's done for. Rolex right into an all-star. They're not even pushing the payload. They're just going in for a thousand vanquishes. This is insane. No, 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 they definitely have been pushing the payload. So I'm not joining at the beginning of a game. Maybe that's where I'm getting a little confused here. I had thought that the game just started. No, they've been pushing this thing for a little while then. Uh, so they're stopping. Well, we, we have to stop the payload. We can stop them at the big wall, right? Come on, Crazy Dave, we need some confidence. Okay, well this isn't turning out perfectly so far. Oh, that soldier, where is he? I got him! Right before the doors closed, that's good. It's hard to see in this fog. But I do see that there's definitely, okay. There's definitely a problem. 
Whoa, whoa, -ho -ho! I wanna see that again. Where's my instant replay? Ow, oh boy. Come on, come on. I could have beat up on that soldier more. My stun didn't last as long from the engineer. Come on, he's almost down. Don't get me with that, ouch. Oh boy. So we sort of had a slow start, but things are starting to pick up a little bit here. I need to be really careful with my next to no health. Okay, I'm in big trouble. Oh, hello, how are you? He's just gonna pop up, start taking me on, I guess. That's okay. Okay, well, they're pushing it, but they're having a hard time reaching this first checkpoint, well, in general. They're, they're, they're making a decent amount of push for the amount of time they've had. It's usually the later end of the three parts of pushing the payload that gets more difficult. Because of, of course, at that point, they have to run farther to get to the payload than we do. Anyways, I'm gonna set this up right here. Also, if I haven't mentioned it, we'll be spending all of our uh, lawn, lawn of Doom bulbs at the end of today's episode. Don't you attack me. You know what I'm gonna do? If you're gonna use that, I'm gonna use this. He hasn't actually hit me too much yet. There we go. Okay, somebody get him. Does he have a friend in there? He does. I'm actually gonna toss that over that way and I toss it right over. That's not good. Whoa, whoa, nice toss from him though. He actually got that really far and because of that, I'm in big trouble. Okay, no you don't. Ah, didn't get as much of that as I was hoping for. But we got him. I was hoping that Oak could protect me but he's no longer an Oak. I can't tell if this is actually gonna land on anything. Those soldiers have been doing a spectacular job. I should've done this first. Um, but they've been doing a spectacular job making it really hard to see. Okay, there's an electric slide right here. Keep getting her, not bad. Okay, these guys are giving me a hard time. And that didn't damage anybody at all. Man, they keep pushing this payload level to achieve. Good to see it. Where did my butter go? I threw it. It didn't seem like it landed anywhere, but it did. There are just so many zombies and they just won't let up on that push. It's crazy. I don't, I don't know what to do about that. Like, it feels like we have less teammates. For like every plant, there's like two zombies. All right, well they got those two. Let's see if we can defend at the electrical station. Maybe, maybe not. They're charging up their weird cart. We don't want that happening. So a lot of these guys are still revealed, I guess by other Colonel Corns. I know there's a super brains running around. We gotta be careful of him. Don't want him getting an early start on everything. Where did he go? <laughs> Who knows? I'm, I'm very worried that I'm gonna turn the corner and there's gonna be a super brains ready to punch my lights out. That wouldn't be good. So she has not noticed me, but everybody else has. I'm out of here. No, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Ah, both of those missed. <laughs> Come on, oh, he is so low on health. Oh, that's not cool. And this soldier's been pushing my buttons. Wait, what is happening? Oh, <laughs> I guess I'm spawning something in. I didn't even know I pressed that button. Okay, who do we got over here then? Uh, Not much anymore. So far they haven't even touched the point. I wanna keep it that way though. That's where things get a little tough. Uh, Get that guy, throw this down. I know that the other guy just used his butter. Might as, well, might as well use ours too. There's somebody up there, there was. I might, yeah, just try to husk cop up here. I think having the upground might be useful. There's a pea shooter over this way. I'm trying to be very careful with how I work around the corners and stuff. Definitely try to beat up this engineer a little bit. He's being healed though, probably by scientists somewhere. We'll definitely get rid of that healing zombie. I can't from this angle, a little tough. Go for it, go for it! Not too bad. Keep going for him. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, I've gotten too distracted. I'm in big trouble. Jeez, I was in the middle of the air when he got me there too. Okay, started well, it's starting to go bad now because once again, they had this really good tactic of totally swarming us. They're basically what we were doing in the last round where they were just being super duper effective constantly. Pretty crazy. Okay, well we gotta get in there fast because they've already gotten the first checkpoint, which is not good. So I'm gonna throw the butter in like that. I'm gonna tell everybody to stay together. That's just a normal Yeti imp. I thought that was like an actual, like mech imp. Okay, no you don't. I'm gonna husk cop. Did that do anything worthwhile? Sort of, kind of. I don't know, but everybody's getting healed. Ouch! 
I need some healing, Sunflower. Could you help me out here? More butter, more butter. I can't believe they got it. Where's our team? Like, seriously though. I don't mean to complain about that all the time, but I feel like for every plant, I see two zombies. It's crazy. All right, well, this is the tough point. I don't think it'll be as tough for them with more than eight players. I feel like that's where the big issue came from, is that there was only eight players. It could be really hard to score all the marshmallows with that in the in the weekly event. So let's see if they have an easier time or not. So with this one, they have five and a half minutes. We wanna get out there and sort of give them a hard time when it comes to actually picking up the bombs at first. That's sort of the best strategy. We're almost in. There's a sunflower joining us too. Well, thank you very much, sunflower. Oh yeah, it's not even there yet. I've never actually seen this thing explode before. Be careful. Be careful. Yeah, I guess it just sort of flies off. It's sort of hard to see. I missed both of those. <laughs> Great. So this is not working out as well as I had hoped, but somebody already has the bomb. Oh no, pea shooter. I'll revive you, but we might be in trouble. No, 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 I gotta reload, gotta reload. There it is, awesome, let's run away, ow. All right, well, I did what I could. I guess it wasn't good enough. Oh well. <laughs> so, so far, they're putting up a good fight. It looks like they have a high chance of winning, but if we put up a good defense, it's definitely like a round, I think that this round still favors plants more than zombies, is final point. We'll have to find out if we're up to the task. So it looks like the first bomb is coming in down this way, down the center. Where is he? I'm trying to see if I can't like poke at him from an angle, but doesn't quite seem to be working just yet. Oh, I see that engineer turret. Definitely want to do away with that if I can. Okay, not good. That was awful. <laughs> what happened to all my mojo I got going on the first round? I don't know. Well, they got that bomb. Nobody's around to defend it. Okay, four minutes left. Can we survive that? I don't know at this point. But I'm pretty happy that we made as much progress as we did with Colonel Corn. Like I've said, the last times we played Colonel Corn, it was sort of kind of a bit of a disaster. He just disappeared. What happened to him? I don't know. What does this guy think he's doing? Apparently nothing I can keep up with. Can you get off my point? Both of you, be gone. Thank you, there's one. This guy still hasn't noticed me. Throw down that. I'm gonna husk hop over these guys if I can. That didn't really work out as well as I was hoping, and then I exploded. But that could have been worse. I got a couple of vanquishes there, and this guy survives? You're kidding me, he's at like one health. They've scored three bombs already, oh no. Maybe I'm getting too distracted. Maybe this is my fault. Let's run back out there. Come on now, you can do it, Colonel Corn. So I don't see anybody with bombs around here just yet. There's somebody, can you stop with that? This is not cool. No, I'm gonna do that to you. <laughs> you aren't doing that to me. Oh gosh, there we go, opponent vanquished. So we have three slots left. And oh no, there's three people with bombs coming in. Gotcha. Okay, so we have to hold this. For 30 seconds is a problem, and other people could come in, ruin our time, ruin our day. Oh, got some good damage on you, though. Oh man, that's a lot of stuff. Let's husk hop, because definitely breaking up that turret is super duper important. This guy's gonna try to run. I think it'd be just important to get rid of him and run, but game's giving me a hard time with that one. Go, 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 go. No, run, ah, oh, darn it. Maybe she'll revive me? Yeah, she is awesome. No, wait, wait. Oh, I think she got vanquished. No, maybe? Come on, come on, I'll protect you. Ah, oh, darn. No, come back, come back. Oh, well, I guess she was protecting against the bomb. That is more important. Yeah, <laughs> it's getting a little too crowded now. Oh, this is getting tough. Three and a half minutes, but they only need two more slots. I think they're gonna win. There are the two bombs they need to score. This is definitely not easy. Come on, run over quick, run over quick. Lots of zombies around. None of these guys have the bombs though, so they're all just a big distraction at the end of the day, right? Oh no, they actually only need one now, great. 
I swear they move so fast. Well, is this the only bomb they can pick up or can they have more than one out in the field? That's the question now. I don't think they can. So if we can just vanquish anybody who goes near this, we'll be fine. Toss that down there, level three achieved. Okay. I can't quite hit any of these guys. So that bomb's going bye-bye. See, these, these zombies are around and causing problems, but they don't have the bomb, so it's like, I don't care too much. Yeah, that's not gonna hit either of them. <laughs> oh no, I'm at like no health. Can I survive? Just hide out for a little bit? I just don't know who has the bomb. Oh, there's somebody over here. Okay, stay together. Where are they? Because that's all that matters. The one person who has the bomb, if we can get rid of them, we win. Where are they? Are they going across the bridge? They are. Oh, that was not enough. Go, go, go. Toss it up there. I don't care about you. <laughs> Be gone. I care about this guy. Come on. Oh, stop him. Stop him. Somebody stop him. Where are the plants? Like, seriously? <laughs> there are no plants. It's all a lie. I'm pretty sure half of my team is plants or zombies dressed as plants or something. There's something weird going on here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there were 17 different zombies on that screen. Oh my gosh, I tried though, I tried. I was really trying to be tactical when it comes to stopping the, whoever had the bomb. Maybe I wasn't doing very good. Look at the Citron, he's just like, yep. Yep, this is happening. Okay, well, that was at least fun, even though it was challenging. I think that maybe we'll wrap it up with that. All right, so in that we earned a couple more bulbs. So we are up to 15 of them and we are going to start spending some now. So hopefully my goal for this one, first off, is to get this right here because this is the, what is this? This is the Scare Bear Mask. We already have the other two pieces of this set. So I wanna be able to get this now um, and showcase it in an upcoming episode. Next episode is the Doom Rose, but the episode after that is the Scare Bear set for the electric slide. Um, we have eight left over. I think we need to work Oh, I wanna get it all, you know? That's sort of the thing. So if I go up to the top, that's a dead end that leads to a legendary hat. But if we go to the right, it leads to the the awesome super brain skin. I feel like I gotta play it safe and work towards that for now. Just in case things just don't work out for me and I don't get it, <laughs> you know? Uh, so we got that. Oh, and we're gonna exactly for this, it looks like King Kong or an equivalent, giant monkey punching through a wall. Gotcha, king of doors, yeah. <laughs> And along with it, we get a free 25,000 coins just for our participation. So we can't quite get this. As you can see, we need 20 bulbs. I keep on calling them orbs. You know what I mean. So we need 20 bulbs here. And then on the top lane, we need what? 18 to get all three of those. That is not gonna be easy. So in total, to complete Lawn of Doom, we need to get 30, no, 40, no. 18 plus 20, 38. Yeah, 18, 20, my brain's fried, okay? <laughs> 38 more bulbs until we're done launching them. Hopefully that happens soon. But yeah, that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment Scarecrow Zebra so that you've watched at the end if you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.